Hey, what's poppin' people? It's your boy G Yi, and I'm here with a couple of my buddies. Uh, we got the Black Shofu. It's Duncan Knee Deep. Wait, what's up? the Black Shofu. <laughs> hey, what's up? We got Roger's bass. What's poppin'? I got that Will of D, friend. And a uh, good player alert. We got Chimpek. What's poppin'? I'm Wait, the so if, if, Shofu, if, Shofu, if Shofu if Shofu is the Black. Ash Ketchum, I'm the brown Gary Oak. All right, there it is. No, <laughs> you're nothing like Gary Oak. You can't be telling lies. We got you're the, literally uh, nothing like Gary the Oak. black Rogers base. We got Shofu in the room. <laughs> and then, of course, we got a uh, BGC legend, player. Jamie Keen. Say what's good. I mean, I don't know if I'm a legend. I'm definitely better than everybody in this chat. But, oh, know. my God. Wait, wait, who even is this person? Who said that? <laughs> I'm not, I'm not arguing any of that. I'm sure everybody could beat me. This man's a world's competitor, Shofu. Uh, I don't care. What does that mean to me? Yeah, what does that mean to Shofu? So we're here today to discuss the VGC 2016 rule set, which was just announced earlier today. Uh, basically, all you guys got to know is that a whole bunch of legendaries are allowed. Uh, what did you guys think when you first saw I, this? I think it's really cool. Like, Kyogre, well, I mean, it's going to be Groudon, the, the metagame, basically. But yeah. like, well, I think Rayquaza is going to be in there because he does cancel out the weather from. No, he doesn't. No, 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 no. If, if you switch in, if you switch in Grodon onto Rayquaza, Grodon's weather takes priority. Right. The the yeah, best switch the... out Rayquaza into Groudon. Rayquaza well, yeah, it's it. it's just it's just standard weather rules, but just yeah. it's going to just be those three against each other, basically. But Hard isn't the rule the rule is that. No, it's, I... I was going to say the rule is that now teams can have no more than two of those Pokemon, though. So you could technically have Groudon and Rayquaza on your team. And yeah, just, you could. Yeah, you could plan for two different options. And I think people will. I think everybody's team is probably going to have Groudon, I, Rayquaza, and Weavile. Look, <laughs> look, 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 look. I, I don't, listen, I don't actually listen to me. That. Listen. Listen, people. You guys are overlooking the most broken Pokemon. Zernia. Zernia is the No, I was about, I was to, about to say it. Zernia is Amoongus. Zernia is Amoongus. Zernia is busted. I've watched, I've watched like... <laughs> Four or five games of VGC 16 already, and every single one of them, Xerneas has got a Geomancy off and swept. That's all like, you know. need. That sounds minute. about right. Yep, we'll it's been two hit it. KO and everything, even the things that resist it. Yep. And That's I mean, Xerneas gets spread. I believe Xerneas gets spread moves as well. Yeah, so it gets like, Dazzling Gleam. Dazzling Gleam, it's exactly. Over. So. Oh my it's god, over. it's over. <laughs> so it's, over. it's definitely going to be Xerneas and a Weather Setter. So yeah. I think it's either it's Zonius and Kyogre, Zonius and Groudon, Zonius and Rayquaza is going to be the meta. And then we're going to have Amoongus sitting there with, with Rage Powder to let Zonius get up a free Geomancy. And oh, Kangas, 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 um, Groudon, and Cresselia seems to be the standard at the moment. Like, everybody's just using those. Like, min yeah. speed, everything. You set up Trick Room with, uh, with Cresselia, and then later on you bring in Zernius and Sweep. Yeah. Like... That's pretty much how every game I've seen is gone, and it's coming down to speed ties with everybody. They're using HP fire, right? Fire coverage? No, no like all I've seen so far is everybody just moonblasting their way through everything. Like, no, nobody really knows how to use the Ubers yet because we're all just used to like the standard Pokemon. So like, yeah, everything's like max offenses. So Groudon's just like getting two hit KO'd by a plus two moonblast, not doing a lot back. I think if people having trouble with Xerneas, you got to bring. Some steel types, you gotta bring that scissor. Yeah, Zonius can take, out, Zonius can take out steel types. It's not like Zonius doesn't have a way to deal with Aegislash, doesn't have a way to deal. But have you ever played a match of Ubers? Zonius runs train in that meta. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it obviously, Zonius is a good Pokemon. Well, well, the thing is, as well, about Zonius is he's like, it's gonna be, you get to bring two of these things. So you could have Zonius next to Groudon. And then, yeah. what's your steel type gonna do? I mean, do any of these mods get follow me? <laughs> Does Lugia uh, get follow me? I don't know. No, time. none of them do. It's a shame. Man. Yeah. I don't know. I mean, see, like, I don't know. It's it's the fact that with the, with, after every generation, every game, these Pokemon get dumber and dumber. <laughs> so what is, like, what is, Zerny, look at Zerny, Zerny is just complete nonsense, dude. Like, <laughs> it is, what? it is completely broken, yeah. But you It's ridiculous. Yuvatel is, Yuvatel is absolute booty, so. What about this idea? What about, uh, what about Zygarde? Unaware? 
What about Zygarde? Zygarde's I mean, Zygarde's so. probably not going to do anything what right now. What about Zygarde? Wait, 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 uh, <laughs> Zygarde's a waste no. of a slut. <laughs> <laughs> because Pokemon, Pokemon Z seems like inevitable, and obviously there's those new forms, but they've confirmed that the double battles are going to be played Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire. So yeah. even if they give Zygarde something, like Zygarde's not, he's irrelevant to this conversation. No one's ever going to use Zygarde. Yeah, it's a waste of a slut. Just, just watch a world champion come with fucking Zygarde and just blow everyone away, and you'll just be eating those words, Roger. Yeah, I, that's yeah. fine, man. I would, I would, <laughs> no, I would, I would be happy with that, but it's not happening. It's Groudon, <laughs> it's Groudon Xerneas, all right, or it's Rayquaza Xerneas. Those are the two. Those are the two. The thing it's with not even bringing, uh, bringing Rayquaza is, would you be bringing Mega Rayquaza? Because then you can't bring your own Mega as your third Pokemon. You know what I'm saying? Oh, or would no, you, be you don't need Mega. You don't need Mega, but it's yeah, always but like, an option. Because you got to remember, Me you can Mega give it another Rayquaza item, and it can and still Mega Evolve if you want it to. Yeah, exactly. You don't need to give it a mega stone. There's no mega stone. You just mega evolve no on its own. You can do choice. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh you yeah. Can choice and choice scarf mega Rayquaza. What exactly. Is the, like uh, you then you bring so Rayquaza, stupid. right? You bring Rayquaza, <laughs> and then if you feel like you need to mega, or if you don't bring your mega for that matchup, then you can mega evolve it just for that extra boost. Right. But you still got a Rayquaza, which is a savage, nonetheless. Mega Rayquaza has like six less attack at level fifty than a level one hundred Talonflame. <laughs> <laughs> Something that makes uh, so Mega Rayquaza up. even scarier, by the way. If you pair it next to Thunderous, Thunderous has no weakness. So oh, like, oh, but... shit. Yeah. I didn't even swag. think about that. You could just run Swag fucking Thunderous, Swag Thunderwave Thunderous. Yeah. Next to a Mega Rayquaza, and just oh my lord. And nothing's yeah. gonna oko thunderous. It's just gonna be out there, because you can't. I mean, it, it'll still everything. take a lot of hits, but like, there's no. Yeah. And then if you're swaggered and there's a mega Rayquaza on the other side of the field, if you don't get through that confusion, you are gone. That works oh. both ways, though, right? Like, well, if yeah, they have a Landorus. Well, yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah. But Landorus is still weak to water. So. And ice like, still weak to ice, just not four times. Those oh, genies. Yeah, yeah. I still well. have a feeling those genies aren't going anywhere. Like, I think the genies are, are staying. Genies are still, I think the Thunderous is going to be one of the most used mons in this meta. I still feel that Amoongus has a place. But yeah. definitely every match, people are bringing both of their super uber mega Pokemon. Because, like, why wouldn't you? Yeah, I, 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 I honestly think we're going to see a chance. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. The problem with that is that it makes the, um, the team picking part of things, the team preview part of things, a lot more predictable. Hmm. Because you see their two, you know they're both coming. Like, you, 99% of the time, they're both coming. To an extent, that already happens, though. Because um, yeah, when someone's I mean, got a Mega Mon on their team, you know they're bringing... if they put a Mega as well, then you've got three of them too much. <laughs> That's the I thing. They I... had, they had like, this type of format, like, five, six years ago, right? But they didn't have the team preview aspect of it. Yeah. yeah. No, they didn't. So that's going to change things as well, because yeah, this they used to have, like, Trick Room Kyogre teams. Yeah. Do you one, guys think there's any viable teams out there that will not use one of the three weather setters? Right. Hear me I out think if you get like cheeky like, with stuff like Aaron, maybe. There's also the hilarious <laughs> like really Aaron. like low low tier Pokemon. There's also the hilarious Golduck option because Golduck can still Oko uh, Primal Groudon with Skull. Yeah. yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. Really? yeah. Like specs or Golduck just. No, no, oh, just... Oh, it's, yeah, it's fire <laughs> ground. It's four times, I guess. Cloud so nine. Golduck, yeah. Golduck and Weavile are going to get a giant jump in use. Wait, That's... I thought only Delta <laughs> Stream <laughs> affected the weather. No, no. Oh, primal. Delta Stream's its own weather. So, like, yeah. when you when you switch in, like, a Kyogre or whatever, like, well, a Primal Kyogre onto Delta Stream, it'll negate Delta Stream and it'll become the new one. But Golduck will actually just cease all the weather going on around it. Yeah. So like so he gets off the scar. Cloud and Nine does work. This is what we're saying is Cloud Nine does work on primal weathers. Yeah. So it'll work with Altaria or uh, like yeah, like normal Altaria. Normal Altaria, you get rid of the weather, and then you can still mega evolve the Altaria things like that. Yeah. Okay, we'll see that on gimmick teams. Mm -hmm. But I'm still saying those weathers are going to be absolutely savage. Yeah. Oh, I don't see any way to run another a team way without one. Of them. Of, Sorry. Another way of getting rid of them is Worry Seed. If you Worry Seed. Oh yeah. If, you if they lose their ability, the weather does go away. Yeah, it's not a time to weather, it's just a time to weather. So worry, like... oh, Jamie, is your, is your Whimsicott coming back? No, I think it might be. I've already, planned a, I've already planned a team around Mega Gengar. <laughs> Again? Disgusting. Completely well, like, disgusting. Mega Gengar? You're going to be pair-strapping people? 
No, no, no. Like, I'm just no, gonna- Perish Trap is dead. Trap. These threats, Perish Trap is dead. How are you Perish Trapping a mutant? <laughs> well, I saw something- <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, how are you Perish Trapping Mega Mewtwo Y? He's gonna blow back every Perish Trap mon in one hit, okay? See, I don't see people using Mega Mewtwo because that wastes uh, both your Mega Slot and your- what, what about you normal like? Mewtwo where you don't have well, to I was use your Mega a joke. I mean, how do you Perish Trap- how do you Perish Trap Mega Rayquaza? How do you Perish Trap Xerneas? These things are blowing away the Parish Trap users so far. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <Things back. laughs> it's all good. Uh, so other than the guys we've talked about already, is there any hope for things like Lugia, ho -Oh, Giratina, Dio? Ho -Oh. I think Lugia ho -Oh? Ho -Oh can get the hell out of here. Ho-Ho has zero <laughs> chance. Zero wait, wait, chance. wait, what do you mean? Zero hey, no, he's chance. Got, he's got to move with a 50% chance to burn. It doesn't matter. He's Look at these spot. threats in this knot. There's going to be a couple gimmick teams with Ho-Ho, but ho is going to get... Ho-Ho is a very good answer hell. to uh, yeah, Groudon hard, Flash. Dude. I think Ho-Ho could yeah. be fine. Oh, 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 could be fine as well. Ho-Ho is actually oh. one of the few answers to Xerneas. It's a hugely bulky mon that resists its stat. So you think Ho Oh is going to be the the, the the like the check for Xerneas? Really? It's a decent like, that's... answer. It's not a great answer, but it's a decent answer compared what to the other is... stuff you have an option. It is an option. Who do you guys think is going to be the Plaza as well? Who do you guys think is going to be like Xerneas? True, killer? it does work like, with the because you have it. I still think with. Steel types. You gotta. I mean, not you gotta really, support cause... them, right? But Aegis Slash and Scizor. Xerneas, Xerneas can two hit KO Aegis Slash in Shield form. Yeah, but two hit KO. He still gets one hit KO by a flash cannon life orb. All right. Fine. Not if you've I mean, got a, a geomancy up. No, yeah, yeah, that's exactly. true. It's over. You you can't let it get that thing off. That's the thing. You yeah. have to punish you it for wasting that turn of physical setting physical up The problem. The problem is physical Aegis slash Oko Zernius with Iron Head. We might actually see physical Aegis slash come back. The 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 thing is with Zernius though is it's paired with Kangaskhan quite a lot. So Kangaskhan yep. fakes out Zernius geomancies, so then, yeah. like. It's all well and good because I mean Kangaskhan can still fake out Aegis Slash because it can just stay in its non mega form and scrappy yeah. fake out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I also really like the idea of. Um, I really like the idea of Raichu in this meta because it does good damage to Kyogre and it gets faint and fake out and it's really, really fast. Mm. And it gets uh, Lightning Round so it'll help with Thunders yeah, if we think Thunders is going to be a lot better. Yeah, so if you're running a Kyogre team, you could run your own Raichu as well. Plus, Thunderous is a problem. You're right. So Thunder Waves, it pulls in Thunder Waves and things. I think the mm -hmm. Raichu might actually have a, a use. <laughs> I mean, Raichu was good in the last in the last one, and it was never particularly yeah. bulky then. So, I mean, I'd imagine it'd stay Sash. Plus, Encore will be pretty good. Yeah, we um, are never going to see a Raichu. Ever. <laughs> <laughs> Not even once. <laughs> All these monsters running around. That, that, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's that's right coming there. Up. Speaking of which... Okay, hey, so. Rooster came through before. I know. Well, that's Raichu is a world either. champion. Raichu is just a strong Pachi Reese. I know he's a world champion. I know. Yeah, Raichu is a. So other than like Raichu and stuff and the genies which we talked about, Pokemon that are already in the meta from VGC 2015, who do you think gets a little boost with these legendaries running around? Roger Weavile. Probably should Dinja. Mawile. Mawile brought back a little bit. Yeah, Mawile's definitely coming back. Mawile is back in, in strength. I think Mawile's probably better than Kanga now. Just because nah, so you're many of these threats. No, Kangaskhan's got Zarnius. too much ability. You were tripping super hard. Zarnius! But Kangaskhan's so Watch out for Zarnius, Zarnius so guys. Well. Watch out for Zarnius. Kangaskhan's always going to be OP, though. So. Watch out for Wonder Card. <laughs> Watch out for that. What do you guys think is going to kind of happen to Mega Lopunny? Do you think he's going up or going down? You can't go down from zero. Yeah, you True. Of course you can. True. Who the hell uses Mega Lopunny? <laughs> Man, I use Mega Lopunny. Get out of here. I'm uh, bad. Did you see? I use her. Yeah, that's terrible. <laughs> uh, what do you do? Like teeter dance or something? It's fake out. <laughs> nah, man. We gotta we gotta do a battle. I gotta right. show you the disgusting things I do. All right. I think all <laughs> fighting types take a, a little notch down because of this monster Mega Rayquaza. Zarnius as well. And yeah. oh yeah, Fairy type Rayquaza, gets a boost Zarnius. too. Zarnius is so scary, man. Zarnius is this meta. The meta game is Zarnius. What's of, of these Ubers though, of these Ubers where like we're only allowed to have two on the team, do you think anything do you think anyone's gonna pull off anything with Dialga, Palkia, or um uh, I've seen Trick Room Dialga be used. Um like Dialga's the, the Trick Room setter. That was pretty cool. Cause it's quite a big fat thing. Xerneas can't always oko it. <laughs> so like and it could do quite a bit of damage back. Like 
It's it, it, Dialga's Dialga's got potential, I think. I don't think so. Oh, I, well, don't, my I boy, mean, Dialga could beat Rayquaza. I don't think Giratina's gonna be seen that yeah. much. I Do you think, think we're gonna see the, uh, the black and white swarm Kira? Any of the Kirams? I don't think we're seeing Ash no. Ramos from. I think we're seeing Xerneas. I think we're seeing Lugia a bit, and then Kyogre, Groudon, Rayquaza, and maybe some Mewtwo's from people who don't know any better. Well, like, they... I've got the the top twelve usage stats from like the last time they did a uh, battle spot competition that was these rules, mm. and the, yeah, the the top twelve. None of them are really surprising. Well, actually, no, Talon Flames in it, for whatever reason. But then again, nice. next to Rayquaza, yeah. be pretty good. Talon Flame with the reduced weaknesses, because Talon Flame doesn't have bad bulk, especially if you build it bulky. It's just its weaknesses that let it down, and with a Mega Rayquaza there, those weaknesses disappear. It's also Ooh, got go baby Adam's making a comeback! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> priority Tailwind, which is, which is useful, because you want to be, you want to be able to guarantee your 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 speed control basically because yeah. that's the most important part I've seen so far because everybody's speed time with everybody yeah yeah I'm but no I feel, like, I'm I feel like there's going to be a place somewhere for Palkia though I'm just like trying to figure out how but I think no, there's going to be nobody is using Palkia when you can no, use I know what I'm saying. Is. I, that's what I'm saying though is I feel like there's got to be like a place no. I'm, I'm, you don't think so? you're wrong Okay. You're actually wrong. I'm actually. That's, I'm like, that's like saying there's got to be a place for Pikachu and all you. That's fine. The place. Nobody's <laughs> using Palkia. Hey, that one Pikachu that learns a uh, icicle crash now. Bring yeah, through. icicle crash. Pikachu. Yeah, when have you ever seen that? <laughs> no. There's got to be a place for all you, right? I was just thinking, since uh, Xerneas pretty much has to run Power Herb, right? Doesn't that leave it pretty susceptible to being taunted since he can't run? Intimidate. Mentally? Intimidate. What? Never mind. What are you talking about? <laughs> talking about i mean i think the, well yeah taunt, taunt will be a bit of a problem for it or like even knock off if you can get it beforehand because you could just like scarf a land i white herb for whatever reason my bad oh oh you saw <laughs> the pikachu thing oh white herb yeah he yeah. doesn't have shell smash he's got the new and improved version of that <laughs> yeah doesn't lower any stats so broken okay uh anyone Basis, else have anything else to say it, it's, we it's basically anything? With a power-up, isn't it just two Quivodances at once? Yeah. Pretty much, yeah. What about the Forgotten Legendary? We've been talking about X version so much. Shofu, since you're on the cover of that Y version, hey, that's what do you think about Eveltal? I'm Zerny. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> oh, Eveltal? Uh, I, don't, I don't think... That's, I don't know. It doesn't sound too impressive to have on a, on a, on a team like... I don't know. Just I don't... Nobody, I mean, nobody has, brought up Yveltal. Sucker, punch, sucker punching Yveltal has its place in Ubers, right? But it doesn't have its place in this meta because it just doesn't. Well, the thing about Xerneas and Yveltal is like they power up your other darks and your other fairies. Like I was watching a game earlier that they were using Mega Tyranitar with Yveltal, so Tyranitar was even stronger because like Yveltal's Dark Aura boosts it, boosts well, Tyranitar too. That's actually yeah. interesting. And you could do the same with maybe a Hyper Voice Sylveon or something. And just oh, God. It. That would be oh, so bad. Yeah. No. I, can't, I can already see it, man. Mega Gardevoir right next to a Xerneas. Or, oh. like you said, Sylveon. Why not all three? <laughs> in, oh. terms of, uh, in terms of Pokemon that you were talking about that aren't legendary, that are just like Pokemon that maybe will get like a, a rise or a little bit of a boost, do you think Mamoswine's going to climb out of UU or no? Why would Mamoswine climb out of UU? We're not talking about UU, we're talking about... Yeah, that's... I know, <laughs> like, no, I'm saying, I'm saying, in, into, I'm, I'm talking about going back in, into, like, VGC, though, I'm just, yeah. like, I'm, I'm thinking in terms of, like, yeah. you know, because a lot of people sleep on Mamoswine. You've the got thing Mamoswine, is, the number shirt, two Earthquake? Pokemon in VGC right now is Landorus, and if that's not enough to make Mamoswine used a lot, right. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, Mamoswine, like, it, it's got kind of a niche, but the problem it has in doubles is it's slow, and there's two things it's got to deal with at once. So and like, it has hella weaknesses. Yeah. yeah. Just like, like Tang Tang yeah. Tangaskan can take it out with Loki. Uh, before, that's why I don't see, that's why I don't see Weavile rising either. Because, yeah, people go, oh, Weavile can kill Rayquaza or Mega Rayquaza or whatever. Yeah, it can just about sometimes if it doesn't Mega Evolve and it doesn't have any bulk. Maybe <laughs> it can kill a Mega Rayquaza. And, you know, if it's, if it's partner doesn't do anything that turn as well. <laughs> yeah, but Weavile is so fragile. That's why they need Primal so Obama Snow right. to get that strong hill up, <laughs> reduces all the weaknesses of Ice-types. <laughs> get that Primal Hippowd onto while you're at it. 
Cause well, Dark freaking... Aura, Dark Aura could work the same way for Weavile as it does for anything else, though, right? I mean, you'd, I mean have, yeah, you'd, have a mo you'd have a monstrously strong knockoff, but you're still yeah. got the problem yeah. of being super, super fragile. Like hyper and having yeah. two enemies, you can only ever kill one of them at a time, and the other one's going to destroy your Weavile. Mm. Especially with especially with Xerneas running around, hitting things with dazzling. Oh blades. well, yeah. I mean, yeah. Xerneas will take takes a shit on Weavile. And flushes him down the toilet, and then I mean, eats him, and then poops him out again. Like, wait, <laughs> calm down. That last well, you gotta take it here. Necessary. The only thing that's actually nice, in my opinion, about <laughs> Weevil is the ability that he's fast and he gets faint, and he's strong. So yeah. maybe playing around with faint and predicting people correctly and breaking their protects and wiping them out and being unexpected is fine. But there are better users out there. Plus, as strong as he is, he's not strong enough to take out Groudon, Kyogre, or Kangaskhan in one hit. True, and they're gonna be in a lot of places. Dark Rise is legal, right? Uh, no, no. The, none of the event ones are okay. So, Smeargle is the only one that's gonna be dark, which is a huge still. shame. Because yeah, I think would be a lot of fun. So, other than Mega Kangaskhan and Mega Mawile, who I think are the two obvious Megas that are gonna be good, what do you think the third one is? Well, there's of course gonna be Mega Rayquaza because of the I mean, uh, I mean, uh, the old, out of the old ones, sorry. Oh, the old ones? Uh, Salamence might still be around, I guess. Because, yeah. like, Metagross. he's still stupidly pro uh, strong. Yeah, Metagross is a, as an answer to Xerneas. I was going to say Metagross Lucario, maybe? Metagross. Lucario is a bit too frail. Because uh, Lucario is not... Yeah, Lucario quite, will get a hit off and then die right away. Yeah. yeah. And also, yeah. it's not resistant to fairy because of the fighting type. Oh, mm -hmm. right, right, right. But I feel like <laughs> Metagross can take out Xerneas. It can do good damage to Kyogre with Grass Knot. It can do good damage to Groudon with Earthquake. It's, it's not also a bad pretty choice. good against Rayquaza, I'd say, because um, it resists. Yeah, that's true. Stabs. It resists the stabs. Yeah. It doesn't so really care I about think, hitting. I think the Metagross is actually going to be quite well used, especially since it's relatively quick. Mm. Thing is, the thing I want to like, because I don't know a lot about the kind of singles meta game. I was kind of maybe wondering, like, what's Ubers just in general, like what what kind of non legendary mons are a big factor there, like that could maybe cross over. I think or... steel types are probably out of the yeah. nine Ubers they're the most useful, but like you said, in doubles it makes it harder because steel is I so mean, uh, weak to things there, when it doubles. There, Jamie, is that list of the two or more of the following? That yeah, makes up at least four of the six mons on the Not that. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty much, Ubers is just Groudon and Xerneas, so which is I think VGC is going to be. Yeah, they use a lot of T-Tar and Extra Drill too if they want to do the weather thing. Yeah, weather teams will run T-Tar and Extra Drill, but you got to remember that regular weather doesn't overcome the primal weather. No, you can't even like you can't even sa set them up like. Yeah, you can't even manually. sunny day. So. Wait, really? Yeah, but no. the thing you can't play is, not sunny day. You can't do anything like that to wipe out the primal weathers. The too only strong. things that wipe out primal weathers. The thing is, for the oh. most part, Extra is going to be able to beat Groudon anyway. Yeah. Well, I mean, it's true. slower than Groudon unless Groudon's running no speed. Groudon don't usually. They're usually bulkier. I think most Groudon are going to run min speed or. Low speed yeah, the, so that they can... They've all, been, they've all been Brave Zero so far that I've seen. Yeah, because you want to set that sun up, or whatever they call it, after the Kyogre is all done. Otherwise, you get caught in the rain, you will get popped. <laughs> <laughs> it's important to note if Excadrill starts rising in usage because it beats Groudon, people are going to start running a bit more speed on the Groudons. Yeah, and yeah. that's always shifting. Mm. Then that just have... comes down to, you know, between, like, who do you, who do you want to prepare for more, Kyogre or Excadrill, though? So Yeah. yeah. Yeah, and I mean, I, I I don't see Kyogre getting that much use just because the the Super Sun is better than the Super Rain. Yeah. Yeah, Especially it's much better. Bulky waters are everywhere, and all of a sudden your bulky water is completely countered by a fire type. Plus, it boosts. <clears throat> it still boosts the chlorophyll users, so you can even yeah. just take out like Kyogre before. Yeah. Before you, they get the, the chance to switch back in. Then you can do all Whereas, like, all water is doing is just powering itself up. It's not really helping anything. Yeah. Palkia, right? 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 Oh, <laughs> there you right, go, Roger. Palkia. Palkia, Palkia yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, man. Well, this was a good talk.
thanks everyone for uh coming through i learned a lot uh if you guys enjoyed the video hit that thumbs up button down below who wants to do my outro uh, yo look it's your boy young shofu back Wait, what, do you have like a specific answer? No. You know, I'm just about to talk. All right, let me talk, man. Yo, it's, <laughs> we all GE's channel, man. What's vibe? It's your boy, Shofu. Hit that like button or we're coming through, running up in your crib and kicking you in the nuts. Hey, 